Hey guys, what's up? Today we're gonna be playing Death and Taxes, so apparently I've heard this game is sort of like Papers, Please. So it's it's pretty cool, I think I like it, because like Papers, Please was good, so if this is gonna be good, then we'll find out right now. Scroll through the comics using the mouse. Okay, so, uh, no, no particularly any writing, I don't know how to English. Book, book says death, I'm pretty sure it's supposed to say death or something. Uh, press arrow key? Oh, yeah, arrow key, literally. Alright, so... This guy is going for a walk. Then he's doing that, uh, that, uh, scene in, uh, in a music video, in a, in a cover, I don't remember. Market. Poke, poke. Oh, there's actually talking, damn. Fire. Why, what, fire? What? I don't quite understand it. Ooh, he has magic. That's what it is. It's magic. Okay, so finally the new spawn has awoken. I'm the new spawn. What a uh, momentous day. I am honored to welcome you into our world. Spawn. Uh, hang on, spawn number 86. Okay, I like 86 then. I, I am fate. I am the keeper of the world order. So let's see, what am I going to respond with? Where am I? What is this? What am I? Hello, yeah, what am I? I am actually curious. You are the Grim Reaper. You are death. That is pretty cool, right? Kind of, I guess. Welcome to your new job as an overseer of Cosmopolitan City. Subdivision number four, the Sun County Wine Region. Never heard of it. I know what you are thinking, and yes, your assignment is choosing humans who have to die. Pretty standard. So what's that got to do with taxes? As it is your first day, try to get to know the system and try not to destroy the world. Yes? Okay, so... I'll try, I'll try. Wait, I have to kill people? I'm not ready for this. Okay, whatever you say. Boss, will I get paid for this? Yes, that's the important question. My dog is literally running around me like crazy. Oh, most certainly, you're to be fairly compensated for every accurate choice you make. Making profiles correctly is the most important part. So it is papers, please, practically. And perhaps eventually a place will appear where the salary is actually useful. Do not get your hopes up right now. Now, I need to tell you the details of the job. Every day I will send you the profiles of some people. Your job is to mark the files with the marker of death, choosing the people who have to die. Then you fax the files back to me. Okay, so yeah, it's kind of like papers, pre please. So I'll get to it. Uh, we are here to keep chaos in check, so on and so forth. Alright, where do I work? I will show you your workplace right away. Follow me. One more thing, this will be your 7 day evaluation period. When the week is done, you will be assessed and either deemed fit or not. We cannot let just anyone work here. So one week to show us what you are made of, I mean aside from the ingredients you are made of. What am I actually made of though, is a question. Day 1. Okay, so how does this work? Huh? Huh? What? Massive wildfire threatens to engulf the whole wine region of Sun, Sun County. Okay. Uh, I, I I don't get it. Letter of Fate. So, Morning Grim, here are the files on humans who are in a life-threatening situation within your domain. No difficult rules and requests yet. I am allowing you to settle in rules for the day. Mark one human to perish with the marker of death. Send me the files by fax when you are done deciding. Good luck on your first day. Fate. Interesting. So where's the, uh, th this is a marker probably. So live, die. Ewald Child Prodigy has been performing brain surgery. I guess you get to live because, uh, you, you like, haven't done anything wrong, I guess? Uh, yes, I don't want to be told so on and so forth. Alright, next one. Has wanted to become a firefighter since they were a little kid as a keen wine enthusiast. Amadou is leading the strike team fighting the wildfire threatening to destroy the Sun County. Well that is very bad because we want people to die and I just saw that message. So more people, death. Okay, there you go. Uh, why, why, why do I put these? Do you want to confirm your choices? Yeah. Well, that is interesting. So how do I know I've made the right choice is the question. Oh, the new death spawn, welcome. How was your first day? Uh, really good, okay, I guess. Bad, a person died. Bad, a person died. 
regrettable, but also natural. Remember, you are doing this for the greater good. It is important work. I see exactly one per person perish today as I asked, did you figure out the best choice? Neither of them really deserve to die, but the best, there were only two options. Indeed, so I am glad you are paying attention in the future. I may require you to make more difficult choices such is the unfortunate law of cosmos. Keep your eye on the letter for future guidelines and keep up the good work. A new day awaits. Have you heard anything? Uh, uh, have you heard? Okay. Nothing is more certain than this. This then. Rainbows and puppies. Uh. Death and. Which one should I go for? Rainbows and puppies. No, no, no. It's death and taxes. What else would it be? Rainbows and puppies. You did well. See you tomorrow. Okay. Bye, cat. I am talking to the cat, right? Okay, so what's the letter today? I hope you found your accommodations adequate. Here are the rules of the day. Follow them and you will be okay. I am handing you another simple task. Rules for the day mark a human with an engineering or industrial background. Ah, okay then. So what's this? Successes in new cancer treatment. The globe, toxic spill ravages ocean and county vineyards suffer continued devastation from spreading wildfires after heroic firefighters coin blaze. Casualties currently unknown. I think I did that. So a neurosurgeon survives breaking most bones in body after near fatal fall from skyscraper for dangerous stunt. How do you survive that actually? <laughs> yeah, how do you? How big is a skyscraper? AI breakthrough imminent. Promises founder of something I don't even know so I think it was like a uh, different background how do I how do I pick up there we go repairing bicycles is a polter's life they own a bicycle shop designing custom bicycles so what did I have to actually do though it's engineering or industrial so I guess it would be all of them yeah I think it'd be this guy right uh oh wait I, I nearly marked him as live all right there we go this guy and a squatter who likes to renovate old buildings or to live in them with friends. They travel a lot by train and manage a community garden. Hmm, I'll let him live. Let's make a world full of hobos. There we go. Homeless people will be the rulers of the new world, I, I guess. There you are. How was your second day in the job? Meh. You do not seem to be enjoying yourself. No matter, it will pick up. Okay. I see many deaths in your region today. Too many. Well, I mean, it, 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 the hobo lived. Well, yep, that's my job after all. No, no, you must pay attention. The rule said one human. Not more, not less. Oh, unfortunately, such errors means I must dock your pay for the day. You may leave. Good night. Uh, I still don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> that would be me in real life. I'm just saying. I'd be like, I still don't know what I'm doing. I think you do. Stop doubting yourself. You have it in, in you to be a great Grim Reaper. I mean, you just I just signed up for a random job, you know? I appreciate the enthusiasm, generally, but do follow the rules. Good night. Okay, cat. I love you. Okay, so what are today's victims? Oh yeah, I have to, I have to read this annoying thing. So, disarmament furthers peace talk. So, more stuff about... The founder, I, 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 don't, I don't know, I don't really care too much about that at the moment. A new day dawns, no special requests today, you should know the drill by now. Just follow the rules and choose the appropriate profiles then send them to me by fax. Okay, so mark two humans with the marker of death. So it doesn't matter which ones. Okay then, I get to make my own choices. Thus far, Herman has had an absolutely crazy life, traveling around the globe with their post-rock band. They have two younger sisters who often join the tours. Okay, I'll, I'll leave you there for now. I'm just going to check the others. Bjorn has been unemployed for nearly a decade. After many failed job applications, they lost motivation to try again to pass time. Has, he has started obsessively watching rom-coms and is able to quote most of them by heart. I mean, if you're 56 and you have not, like, been employed for, like, what, a decade? I mean, yeah, you, you don't really have much to live for anyways. Don't worry about it. It, he is a distinguished war veteran. These days, a well-regarded passenger airplane pilot. They have five children and a wife. As a hobby, Columbus is very interested in the history of religious buildings. 
Okay, then you get to live because you are not really that old. You are young, so you get to live. And, uh, wait, who's this one? I think this one was the youngest. 18. It has been said that uh, Matthias talks too much. However, they themselves think they may not be talking at all enough. Space radiation is a passion and they are endlessly fascinated by black holes. Well, you're going to be fascinated by this random fact. <laughs> that you're going to just be dead soon. I guess. I feel so bad for that one, to be fair. <laughs> well, there you go. That's all it is. Three live, two die. Only two. So, in the next video, I'm going to be finishing off this. I'm probably going to cut this in half, actually, and just put it as two of it's too long. And I'm going to also do a all endings video if it has multiple endings. So hopefully you enjoyed, make sure you like the video, subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next video. Tell me if you want to see this on the next episode too. See you guys later. Bye-bye.